lot of powerhouse yes. teams, and in today's game, they really want to grind it out. Adishina, last uh, two seasons ago, she was part of the mythical five. As Kone, great box out on Adishina. Oh, nice lead pass. Yanez off the glass, and that is the first field goal, ladies and gentlemen, between these two teams. Adamson, well, close to four minutes already, used in the first quarter. Padilla. Nice pass. Underneath the basket, there is Etang, puts it in with a foul as well. Take a look at that run by Adamson. Adishina, great pass there to Etang. Etang. There's Adishina. Nice move inside the paint. Butterfingers lost it. Padilla thought about it. Nice ball movement by the Lady Falcons, and they find the open woman for the shot. Padilla again pushing the pace. Now it's Adamson in a hurry. Adeshina, yes, what a turnaround. What a great move by Adeshina. Under four minutes to play in the first quarter. And UE still only one field goal. Meanwhile, it's... For Adamson and really making UE stay at two points. And for Angela Alaba, she was 0 for 2 from the field against UP as you see Adeshina score. Converting the turnovers of UE into points. Angela? Oh, she is 3 for 3 from the field after going 0 for 2 against UP. Jessica Apak, 7 to shoot. Apak, the pass. An extra pass. Ooh. You can see that Adamson is really sharing the basketball. Yeah. A steal. As Mazo. Nice little crossover for Buscar. But again, another turnover. Turnover number 10 for the Lady Warriors. Nice pass. Off the glass. It's good. Apag knocks it in. An even bigger lead against UE. Ruiz drives. There it is. Just the second field goal of the Lady Warriors. What a Take a look at this strong drive and the floater. But that's why we have quarters in basketball, a fresh start here, so to speak, for the Lady Warriors. But Azo off to a good start for the Lady Falcons, knocks in a three. Gennady is 0 for 5 from the field. Manlimos from the elbow knocks it in. Back to back field goals, 5 0 run. Right to Coach Ryan Monteclaro. Meantime, Cruz back in the game, number 28. Daniela Cruz for UE. There's the third field goal. Yanez. Really like that physicality as Manlimos, after the turnover, gets a steal and a nice pass for the easy layup for Limbago. Limbago, Yanez. Blocked. Great defense coming from Ornopia. Three against one. Limbago once again. Limbago on a personal four point run. It, it seems like an easy switch for Adamson from defense and really going strongest way possible in the offense. Oh, nice looking high arcing three for Ivy Yanez, who has been the only spark offensively for UE. But a quick answer. They have yet to find an answer to whatever Adamson is yep. throwing at them. Cruz, well, first back-to-back -back set of field goals for UE, Marga. To break the, the runs that Adamson is making. Nice pass, a great catch, and another basket. Three straight field goals for Adamson. Ganade pressured by Maso. Oh, nice little give and go. And a basket for Kambakone. Great read by Ronquillo. She is one for three from the field. Nice cut by Mignano. And that push shot is good. But they run the plays perfectly. I think it's also the maturity that Adamson has being the more veteran team. Point guard, a hard pick set by Ronquillo. Ronquillo spots up. And there you go, there's the conversion. After taking that three, and especially when it goes in, and the same will do for Alaba. Nice pass, Ruiz open. Too strong, Yanez picks it up and puts it in. Are not giving up this early in the game. So you can see them going for the offensive rebounds.
Conquillo hands it off. Here's uh, Ruiz. Ronquillo for three. Oh, got it again. Two threes for Ronquillo here in the third quarter. Allowing you to cut into that deficit. But right now it still stands at 13. Yanez will knock in a three again. Take a look at that play by Yanez. On the floor. Beg your pardon. Elaine Etang is the only remaining starter for Adamson. Limpago from outside. Oh, what a big answer right on cue. That's their first field goal since about the nine-minute mark of the third quarter. Ganade. First field goal for Jersey Ganade. Yui is now much faster. They're a step faster than Adamson. They're also reacting to what Adamson is throwing at them. Exactly shown in that play. Earlier, I feel like... And Yui has been. After trailing by 24, Etan going left. Or Nopia puts it in. She picks up her dribble. Ganade coming down to a minute remaining in the third quarter. Or Nopia knocking it away. Two against two. Oh, nice pass. Apat with a the finish. They kick it out to Ronquillo looking for the baseline. Almost traveled and turns it over. Mazo has it. Oh, Mazo is too fast for the defense. Or Nopia puts it up. Coming from Luis. That shot, no good, coming from Adeshina. And Adeshina trying to show a bit of a range there. The top reverse for Catherine Ruiz. That pass of Ganade. And look at that shot by Ruiz. Open look, and nothing but net. Before that, take a look at that shot. And Adamson with another seal. Apag with the left. Yes. Quick five-point run for Adamson. Three and a half to go in the fourth quarter. Adeshina lost it. Yui is off and running, but so is Adamson. Tambakone on the break. Got it or the teams that you lost to in the first round right. so that you can get that twice to beat advantage coming into the final four. Well, for Adamson, that's going to be... They, they, they want to get wins against USC and NU. Those are the teams they lost to against the defending champions, but lost against NU by 22. You'll never know. Bilog ang bola. That's true. Coming into the second round, so... Meanwhile, UE goes back to the drawing board. That's been a roller coaster ride for UE, but more lows. Then highs as Ronquillo knocks it in from outside. But a great performance from the bench uh, by coach Ryan Monteclaro, allowing them to win by 12 points at the buzzer against UE. And they have 24 total assists wow. in today's game, limiting their turnovers only to 17. Also, their steals only at 17.